picture hanging hardware for sheetrock walls. I'm going to be hanging this painting, Slough Creek Survey by Perry Austin, above this chair. I won't use a nail. That's a good way to get the sheetrock torn and the artwork on the floor. This sawtooth works great for very small, very lightweight pieces. Beyond that, it's really not, not good to use. These look great, but I've seen them used with art that's just too heavy for the hanger and they unbend. These are the common hangers that framers staple to the picture wire of your artwork. The two sizes here are 30 and 50 pounds. They can be used in just sheetrock, no need to find a stud. And I'm not going to look for a stud in this wall. I'm centering the painting on the chair, so I really don't have to do a lot of measuring. The outside of the frame is 20 inches high, 32 inches wide on this 12 by 24 painting. I'm using two 30 pound hangers, not because the painting is heavy, it only weighs about four pounds framed, but it's so wide that it can easily hang crooked if a door slams. So I'll be nailing the hangers at the same height, about three inches apart to stabilize the painting. Remember to check the distance between the top of the frame and the picture wire. If you're hanging an older piece, check to make sure that artwork's hardware is really sturdy. For stubbornly crooked paintings, try a little bit of removable adhesive putty between the frame and the wall. It won't move. <laughs> 